In September 1941, Jews above the age of six were forced to sew a star on their clothing to show that they were Jewish. The following year, the law was later brought to France, Belgium, the Netherlands, Slovakia, and other countries that the Nazis controlled. Hi, my name is Dylan, and my topic is the Star of David. The Star of David is a symbol of Judaism today, but actually was not a part of Jewish history before the Holocaust. The star is actually supposed to symbolize King David's shield that he used in battle. On the screen is the original Star of David. As you can see, the triangles intertwine. Before the Holocaust, some people would say that this symbolizes that the Jewish community will not be separated. Before the Holocaust, this original star was a sign of hope. But during World War II, it was a symbol of Nazi persecution. In 1941, the original Star of David was somewhat changed into two thin triangles. The whole figure was yellow, with the word Jude written in Hebrew in the middle. During this time, Jews over the age of six were required to wear this star. I chose this topic because the Star of David started the nationwide persecution of the Jews and turned everyone against the Jews. On April 1, 1933, the Nazis carried out their first nationwide persecution of the Jews by boycotting Jewish businesses. Stormtroopers, or SA, stood in front of Jewish businesses and painted yellow and black Star of Davids on the windows. They wrote on the windows, Don't buy from Jews, and also, The Jews are our misfortune. Other Germans walked past these windows and saw their opportunity to blame someone for their misfortunes. Acts of violence occurred throughout Germany and against individual Jews. Jews looked for help from the police, but they turn, too turned against the Jews and joined the Nazi party. In conclusion, the Nazis used the Star of David, which used to be a symbol of hope, to persecute the Jews and label them as a race that needed to be gotten rid of. They put the Star of David on Jewish businesses and wrote on them that Jews were the source of all of Germany's problems, that they were the reasons people were poor and unemployed and homeless. It turned the entire country against the Jews, who looked for help from local authorities or someone that would save them from this persecution. Unfortunately for some, it never came.